Welcome to Caseware Quick Vids. This video demonstrates how to set up and work with peer-to-peer -peer synchronization in working papers with SmartSync when using an external drive with a built-in router. Using an external drive with a built-in router to set up peer-to-peer -peer synchronization simplifies the process for both the parent and the connecting peers. The drive component allows for convenient storing of the top-level engagement file, while the router offers a simple way for peers to access the top-level engagement file. Using this method of setup, the parent no longer has to create local user accounts and no longer has to specify sharing permissions for individual users. As a result, this is now a recommended best practice for those working in working papers with SmartSync. Let's begin. For this demonstration, the Lassie wireless space is used. This external drive has three LAN ports for peer connections. As you can see, I am connected to the drive with a network cable. Note that I do not need an internet connection for this setup. Instead, I will only require these LAN ports. As a peer parent, you must connect to the external drive. Then, in Windows Explorer, Navigate to the top-level parent engagement file. In this case, it is called Easy SmartSync on Location. Open a second instance of Windows Explorer and navigate to the location of the external drive by either clicking on Network and locating the drive or by typing in the IP address of the external drive. Each IP address will have a unique identifier. Remember to type in two backslashes before entering the address. Now, move the top-level engagement file onto the external drive. As a peer, connect to the external drive using the LAN ports. If there are not enough cables between the peers, alternate connections, but ensure that the external drive is connected for the entire procedure. Now, open Working Papers. Select Open. Then select Computer. Navigate to the external drive. Again, you can do this by selecting Network and finding the name, or by typing in the IP address. Once again, I'll type in the IP address. Now, locate the top-level engagement file. In this case, it will be Easy SmartSync on Location. Click on the Working Papers file and then select Create Synchronized Copy to create a child synchronized copy onto your local drive. Note that the synchronized copy will be saved to the location specified in the default paths. After a peer connection is established, Working Papers SmartSync can be used regularly. While connected to the external drive, peers will always be online. Choose to work offline if there are not enough connections available to the external drive. You can reconnect at a later time to synchronize your copy. As a parent, when connected to the external drive, you will be able to verify the users that are synchronized to the sync copy by accessing the properties on the sync toolbar. Once peers have located the sync copy, it will be displayed in their synchronization drop-down menu below the parent file location. As long as a synchronized copy is shared on the drive, the sync copy will be shared and peers will be able to access the file. This concludes the quick vid on setting up peer-to-peer -peer synchronization in the field using an external drive with a built-in router. For more information, including documentation and online help, see the related links. Thank you for watching Caseware Quick Vids.